it's Rianne, and today I'm going to be showing you some sorority recruitment outfit ideas. Let's go in and talk about round one. We call this open house at my school because you'll be going around to all of the sorority houses and having a few short conversations. You'll probably be walking a lot this day, so I suggest some comfortable shoes like these T-strap sandals. Although this is a casual day, you should definitely take Lauren Conrad's advice and dress a little bit nicer than you think you should. I think a romper like this one from Lulu's is a great way to be casual, yet still just dressy enough. With each outfit for recruitment, you either want to pick a statement piece of jewelry, a bold color, or a fun print. These are great ways to be memorable and spark conversation, which are two things that definitely help a lot in recruitment. As you can see with this one, I decided to go with the bold print. Now let's move on to round two. At my school, this is the day when the remaining houses you're rushing will be showing you all of their house tour and telling you about their philanthropy. The attire for this day is described as still casual but dressier. This outfit is something you might wear to brunch with your mom and dad. I absolutely love this classic navy dress from oasap.com and the, overlace, the overlay of lace adds a fun twist. As you can see, I topped it off with this fabulous statement necklace that really catches the light and sparkles. I wore this during recruitment and I got so many compliments. And I decided to pair this with some nice nude wedges, just to elongate the legs a little bit. Next, we move to round three. This day, you'll want to wear a dress that you might wear if you were a guest at a wedding. What I love about this one is that it's bright, which is memorable, but it's also really classic. This dress is also from Lulu's, and it's linked below with all of the other links to all the other dresses. I love the way the neon coral color really adds an updated feel to this classic silhouette. I paired this dress with pearls and nude pumps to keep the classic theme going. As you can probably tell, as you go through recruitment, more and more, the outfits are going to get dressier and dressier each day, so be sure to keep that in mind when you're doing your outfit planning. I also really love how this dress totally makes me look more tan because of the neon colors. Preference round is the last round, and during this round you'll visit anywhere from one to three of your top choices for sororities. For this round, you'll want to wear a dress that is semi-formal. This might be something you might wear to homecoming, but a standard prom dress is probably too dressy, so you want to go with something that's in the realm of a short cocktail dress. This sequin number from Lulu's is perfection. I love how it makes a statement without being super overbearing or over the top. I paired it with classic black pumps just to make sure to keep like a classic vibe and I am so obsessed with the sequins and how they catch the light, in case you haven't noticed. I hope you guys liked this video and remember all the links to the dresses can be found below. You can also click here to see my sorority recruitment tips video. Good luck in recruitment ladies!